Major League Baseball has placed Hall of Fame second baseman Roberto Alomar on the ineligible list after an investigation into a sexual misconduct allegation made against him, Commissioner Rob Manfred announced on Friday. Here's the statement in whole. MLB hired an outside law firm to look into the allegation against Alomar. As a result of Manfred's conclusion, Alomar can no longer work for the league or for any team, including on the minor league side. Alomar released his own statement in response. It reads, the Baseball Hall of Fame also released the following statement, the Blue Jays, meanwhile, announced their intent to sever all ties with Alomar effective immediately, as well as removing him from the level of excellence, by taking down his banner at Rogers Center's Mike Rosenstein reports that, a person familiar with the issue said that a complaint against Alomar was filed with the Blue Jays months ago, alleging he acted inappropriately in an incident that occurred several years earlier. Alomar had previously worked with the Toronto Blue Jays in a special assistant role. That position was eliminated late last year in a cost-cutting move. Alomar, 53, was inducted into Cooperstown in 2011 after receiving 90% of the vote from the Baseball Writers Association of America. He was enshrined despite allegations of domestic violence from then-wife Maripoli Rivera. Rivera accused Alomar of pushing her and threatening her with a knife, in a 2010 article. 